Welcome to the homework for lesson 16. This is module 6 of grade 1. Please write your name here first. And we're getting really close to it now. This is about as close as you're going to see it. This is the old school regular way to do um, two digit addition. So what we're going to do is we're going to draw the quick 10 way that we've been practicing this way here. And then we're going to do, we're going to just going to write down the numbers. And then notice here, I'm going to zoom in so you can see it. Old timers will call this carrying over. We write it down there instead of up here. But really, I don't care. If you write it here, if you write it, if you write it down here or up here, as long as I see it has to be there and then when it's up on top if you're gonna do it that way because that's the old-fashioned way to do it if you're gonna do it that way I want it right here I don't want the one right that when you make a 10 out of this out of that 9 and that 3 just like you do here when you make that 10 I want to see that 10 here so I know it's with the other 10s what I don't want to see is is I don't want to see that 10 over here somewhere because now it looks like there's a hundred there. So be careful where you put it. You can either put it down here in the bottom. There are reasons for putting it there. You stood that way, and you've seen it that way enough to put it. Depending on what your teacher says. Now, if your teacher says don't do that, then you know, obviously you do want to get credit for your assignment, so don't do it. But um, practice it the way your teacher tells you to do it. Here we go. Solve using quick tens and ones drawings. Remember to line up your drawings, right? Line up your drawings means make sure you have your tens. Uh, your tens are uh, on on the left and your ones are on the right and they're kind of grouped together. And we're going to rewrite the number sentence vertically. So we've got a couple of pages of this and I'm going to do it fast because otherwise this whole video is going to take uh, more than a half an hour and nobody wants to watch a homework video for that long. So uh, once you see how once I get started, you you'll get a great a pretty good idea of what it what it's supposed to look like, and then just pause the video, do a bunch of them yourself, and then watch the video to check them or just skip ahead. I won't know. Thirty nine, one two three, one two three four five six seven eight nine. Please use five group rows. It'll make things so much easier for drawing these pictures. 45, 1, 2, 3, 4, 10s, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1s. And now here I'm seeing two fives. Right, and it looks like they're eating this 4, which is what's left. And I count my 10s. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10s. Now you might be just looking at these numbers, and maybe you can do this in your head already. But you're like going, well, I just need to add... 39 and 45 and I want my I want to see my ones right on top of each other and I want to see my tens just like that so I just so I can see my tens and think well if that's three plus four that's seven and this uh, nine plus five that's 14 so that's 714 but wait a minute I'm supposed to have 84 that's what happens when you start with the tens first. Just like when you do the pictures, uh, you have to go back and fix it. You're going to have to go back and change your tens and fix it because you really have eight tens. You don't have only seven. So in order to fix that, that 14 that we had down here, look at your ones first. That 14, what I'm going to do is make, sorry, that one, I'm going to put it right here. And now I can add it to the other tens. Three plus four is seven, and one more is eight. And the rest of these are going to go a lot faster. So if I'm going too fast, pause it or go back over the. Uh, if I went too fast, go back over it and watch it again. It's a video. I won't know how many times you have to do it. Uh, 64, one, two, three, four, 
five, six tens, one, two, three, four ones, twenty-eight is two tens, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight needs two more, so there's a ten. I have two ones, and I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety-two, and eighty-four. I'm going to write back over here the ninety-two. So we have sixty-four, twenty-eight. Adding, put that over here, and now let's see. I've got uh, four plus eight, that's twelve. So there's a ten, right? Like the ten that I circled. I'm gonna count that with the other tens, and then I have two ones left here. Then I'm looking at six plus two, which is eight, and one more, which is nine. Ninety-two. Forty-seven. One, two, three, four. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, thirty-eight is one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This needs eight needs two more, and there it is right there. So I have one, two, three, four, five ones left. And my tens I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eighty-five. 47 plus 38. Now, just like it did here, I had to make a 10 because it's 7 plus 8 is 15. So that was a 10 and 5 ones. 10s go over here with the, with the, all the 10s have to go there and all the ones have to go here so you can't just you can't squeeze a 10 in over here and make that 15 the tens have to go with the other tens and then we count them when we count the other tens just like we do with the picture 4 plus 3 7 one more 8 85 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 1 2 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 there's a 10, zero ones, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight tens for 80. 53, 27. There's a 10, but with no ones left over, and 5 plus 2 is 7, and one more is 8 for 8 tens, 80. 38. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 and 48 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 just needs two more that leaves us with six ones and then the tens there's 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 tens 86 38 plus 48 and you can see we had to make a group of 10 here so we know 8 plus 8 is 16, so the 6 goes here, and the 10 and the 16 goes there. It has to go there with the other 10s. 3 plus 4 is 7. One more is 8. 86. 53. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, tens. 1, 2, 3, 45. 1, 2, 3, 4, tens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let's count them up. 3 and 5, that's only 8 ones, so there's no 10s to make here. We just count what we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And this is, these are the times when it's super easy to look at the digits like this. And you just look at 5 plus 3 is 8, and 5 plus 4 is 9. And more of the same. Remember to line up your drawings and rewrite the number sentence vertically. 79. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 10 and 1, 2, 3, 4. We can make a 10 here. Three ones left, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, tens, ninety three. Writing it with numbers vertically, seventy nine, 
14. And we can see we have to circle that group of 10, and we're going to have three ones left, and there's that group of 10 that we had to circle. 7 plus 1 plus 1 is 9. There's the 93. 28, two tens, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 47 is 1, 2, 3, 4, tens, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Looking at our ones, this 8 up on top needs just two more to make a 10. And then we have five ones left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, tens, 75. 28 plus 47. We can see right here from looking at our picture, we needed to make a group of 10. So there's that 10. And the 15, the five ones for the 15, that goes there. And then we just add our 10. We just count up our 10s. 2 and 4 is 6. 1 more is 7. 75. Fifty-eight plus thirty-three. One, two, three, four, five tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ones. Thirty-three is one, two, three. One, two, three. And looking at this, eight, and there's two more. So there's a ten with one one left. And I'll count my tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety-one. Looking at it with the numbers vertically, we've got 58, 33. Be careful that your ones and your tens, when we say lined up, that's what we're talking about. They should be above and below each other like that. And we've got the 8 plus 3 would make 11, right? So that, that's, that means there's the 10 that we had to circle, right, over here. That's the 10 and one more. So there's the 10 and then there's the one more. There's the ones. So the ones go there and the tens go with the other tens. And now we can count all of the tens. 5 plus 3 is 8 and one more is 9. 91. 19 is a 10, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 66 is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10s, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1s. Looking at this 9 on top here, we just need one more to make it a 10, so we loop that guy in there, and there's our 10. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1s left. And now we count our tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight for 85. Writing vertically, we're going to see 19, 66. It's a very good year. And uh, 9 plus 6, we know that's going to come out to 15 because we just, we just looked at it. We just drew a picture and counted it, right? Because so, it makes it 10 and 5 ones. Right, it made this 10 and then it made these five ones. So there's the 10 and there's the five ones. And now we count our tens just like we did with the picture we count. Now we're going to add them up with the numbers. And these are all tens right here. So we're going to add those together. One plus six is seven, and one more is eight, 85. 'Takes a little getting used to working up and down instead of left to right. Thirty oops, getting ahead of myself here. Thirty-nine, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Fifty-nine is one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Drawing a lot of dots and a lot of tens. Uh, which is can get tedious when you're working with larger and larger numbers. And that's why we, we're starting to get used to drawing the, we're drawing the pictures because it's, it's easier to count them. But we're also working with the numbers because it gets a lot easier. Once you get good at the numbers, then it's a lot easier to write down the numbers to show your work. So we need this 9 needs a 1 more there. And we've got 8 left. Eight ones left and count our tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety-eight. 
and vertically with numbers it looks like this 39 59 9 plus 9 is 18 and we know that because we got when we added together we got a 10 and we had 8 left so that 10 and that 8 makes 18 remember that you know teen numbers that's how it works 10 plus any number of one so that makes a teen number so that's 18 that's the eight ones and there's the 10 right there i put that with the other tens because it's a 10 it's not a one so it can't go in the ones place it has to go in the tens place and now I just add up our tens three plus five is eight and one more is nine 98 one two three four one two three four five six seven eight nine one two three four one two three four five six seven eight this nine needs one more and there are seven and one two three four five six seven eight nine ninety seven forty nine forty eight and we know we're going to have seven ones left and there's the 10 that we need to count like the 10 that we the 10 ones that we circled that we have to put that there to count it as a 10 4 plus 4 is 8 and one more is 9 97 